Hey guys, it's Taylor. Welcome to this tutorial. I'm sorry I haven't posted a video in a while, and I didn't post at the time I was supposed to post it, but I'm posting it now. I'm sorry, and hope you forgive me. So today I'm going to be showing you how to put text or insert text over a current image in Adobe Dreamweaver. Having this knowledge is actually really helpful and can really help you with things that you do in Dreamweaver. So what we want to first do is insert our image. Um, and then we want to go down to the properties tab. The thing that we want to know in our properties tab is our width and our height of the image. Once you know that, you can right click and hit cut. Now in this area that you just hit cut where the image used to be, you want to right click and then hit edit tag TD. Now in the general tab, you want to put the dimensions you just remembered from the properties from the original image. Then you want to go to browser specific and browse for that same image. And hit OK. Now once you do that, you can write any text you want. Now let's say you want to put text right in this box. As you see, I have a box and a full image right here. And let's say I want to have text right only in this box. Um, as you know, if you've used Dreamweaver before, you can't hit space or tab. None of those will work to move the to move where the text goes. So what you have to do is insert a table. So go to insert and then table or control alt T. And then for the rows make it one and for the columns make it one. This completely is optional depending on your situation. And then what we want to do is go to the properties tab, find the align and set it to center and then drag it out a little too big All right, once you got around, all right. So once you're happy about where you want the table to be, uh, there's one more optional thing you can do, and that's to eliminate the border. So go to the properties tab again and find the border and set it to zero. Once that's done, you can insert your text wherever you want. At any time, you can readjust the table width and length as much as you want to your liking. Now, as you see right now, when you insert your text, it's vertically in the middle. Um, let's say you want to have this text at the top. Very easy to do. All you have to do is go to the properties tab again, find the vert or vertical tab, and set it to top. And there you go. Thanks for watching, and if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, please post them below. I will also be posting a new video and a short film really really soon. I'm working on actually a short film. Not um, not a serious one but just a quick short film that will be like two minutes. Um, just, uh, just an idea I thought of. Um, yeah, I'm still working on that. So thanks for watching guys. If you have any other questions, comments, or concerns, you can co post them below, just what I wrote. Uh, you can also go on my site and post them there. I'm still currently working on the website. That's what I'm working on right now. Um, this is somewhat of a preview. I don't want to show you the full website since it's kind of still a secret. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching and I'll see you later. Bye.